Hello everyone. Thank you so much for making time to talk with me earlier today. This is Jeff once again with Zucker Marketing and as promised, here's your website analysis. So we'll be going over some few things that can actually help you rank higher, bring you more traffic, and of course, get you more customers. So let's go ahead and start off with your website. You actually have a pretty good looking website. So we have your logo at the top. You have your address, call to action, pretty good photos, a nice layout. Um, so there's actually just some few things we're going to get over for us to make sure we get you on top of the search list. One thing I can tell you right off the bat is that Google loves content. Google actually would like to see a minimum of 1500 words on a homepage. And in addition to this, the more content you'll have, the more you look like an expert in Google's eyes. So of course, if you want to beat out the competition, you'd want to have 1500 words or more. So let's go ahead and do a quick count just for us to see how many words you have on your homepage. So currently you have 482 words, not a bad number. However, we're still quite behind with the goal of 1500 for us to actually be considered by Google as a trustworthy website. Another thing I would like to talk about are keywords. Google is actually look, looking for keywords. It's looking for what the site should be found for. So if you have the exact words listed multiple times on your website, you're going to be really relevant for that search. And of course, Google is going to be willing to put you higher in the results. So I actually did a quick search of the roofers in your area. We'll be talking more about the results that we have here, starting off with the sponsored. So these are actually, you know, the paid ones wherein people are paying ads for their website to show up here. So we're actually not going to be talking much about the paid ones, but rather, we'll move on to the next part. So this right here is what we call the map pack. And I actually see that you're already listed in the map pack, which is perfect. So one good thing for us to do differently now for us to get you or get your website boosted on the map pack searches is to, you know, um, add your information to many more directories as possible, like ng.com, Yelp, Yellow Pages, and so on and so forth. That way, we can actually get you higher in to the map pack results. Um, moving on to the next part, these are what we call the organic searches. So these are actually all the website that ranks higher without people paying for any ads, just because they're doing some certain things. And that's exactly what we're going to talk about and analyze. So we actually pulled up the website that shows, um, or the, the website that actually shows on top of your website. And we'll see what they're doing differently. So yeah, looking at their website, they also have a pretty good looking website. They have their logo at the top, pretty good photos, pretty good amount of content, and they also have client testimonials. So yeah, let's go ahead and dig deeper with the numbers instead. This is Ahrefs, one of the paid tools that we're actually using for us to have some more information on the back end of your website. We'll be talking about the numbers, so let's start off with DR. So this would be the level of trust that Google has in your website, and UR would be the strength of your website. Backlinks, on the other hand, this or other website, that refers to your website, so they're like shoutouts from different directories, like Yellow Pages, Yelp, and alike. I also have your competitor's website pulled up on another window. So we'll be comparing the numbers and we'll see what they actually have differently as to why they're currently ranking higher. Um, looking at DR and UR first, it actually shows that Google finds your website stronger and a more trustworthy website. Well, the reason for that is because you have more backlinks with them and you also have more keywords which resulted to more traffic while they only have 292 backlinks and they also only have 195 keywords. Their edge now would be on the referring domains. So let's go ahead and discuss more about the referring domains or what we call the backlinks as well. Um, so if you can see, these are all the directories they're listed in that actually brings them a lot of attention and a lot of traffic. That's why they're also currently ranking so high in the searches. We'll talk more about the keywords as well. We'll discuss the importance of the keywords so <clears throat> if you can see the organic keywords these are all the keywords they have listed on their website so you know when customers search for the specific words 
their website will show on top of the list. And if you also look at the numbers and their volume, these are all the hits or clicks that they're getting um, with the help of each keyword. So that's actually how important in choosing the right keyword is. That way, more customers will be able to find your website easier and quicker. Another thing I would like to share about keywords as well is what we call the hidden keyword. So let's use this photo as an example. If we save this photo and instead of naming it with a generic file name, you can actually rename it with a hidden keyword and you know do the same thing with the other photos you have here. That way you'll have more hidden keywords on your website and not only that, for those words to not to be repetitive as well. So just to wrap things up, the most important things that you can definitely do to improve or maintain your ranking would first be the amount of content or we're going to add more words to your homepage. That way, Google will actually consider you as a more trustworthy website and a stronger website. Next would be the backlinks where we're going to add your information to more directories as possible. That way, we can bring you more traffic and not only that, for us to get your website boosted and to be on top of the map packs as well. Last but not the least will be the keywords where we're going to help you out in choosing the right keywords on your website. That way, more customers will be able to find your website faster and easier. So that's actually all that I have for now. If you have any further questions, feel free to call us or email us so that we can actually tell you the next steps and the other things that we can do. Thank you so much for your time. You all have a wonderful day. Bye.